My name's Craig. <laughs> hey, welcome back. Hey, this is Craig. This is Craig. We're climbing the stairs again with We're the arachnid kid. The arachnid kid. It's a way better name. Yeah. And he's also like a kid, so, you know, he's a yeah. high school student. Yeah. Played by a 34-year-old. <laughs> Rub some dirt in your eye. <laughs> Rub some dirt in your eye. Oh, nope. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Your little goblin junior. <laughs> I don't need the health. I'm actually doing good. <laughs> don't worry with the males, because I, I used, used to, to be one. one. I love Mrs. Doubtfire. What a great movie. Great film. Great, great film. Yeah, why Why does he look like that? Yeah, Vulture looks like ass. He looks like toasted shit. <laughs> he looks like... He looks like if... If you made like a human version of a can of creamed corn, that'd be the vulture. I love just this huge plank of wood, just like it's just completely going, it's going. unhinged. It's just like yeah, yeah. Ah shit! Oh yeah, you're fuck. just you're just in the fire. Ah oh, god. Ah, uh. you're in the fire and the flames, like that Dragon Force song. Yeah. You know they sped up the recordings? Did they? Yeah. Cheaters. I mean, like, it's still impressive even at the slower tempos. Is it? Like, as far as technique. Like, composition, it's like, mm, all right. Um, but, like, technical, te uh, technique-wise. Te te technique? Technique? Squidward! Squidward! Technique! Squidward! The pelvic woo! Uh, Squidward! Outside. I love that. Fucking what episode is that where Patrick and, and uh, Spongebob oh, are like shit. running away and then Patrick gets grabbed and he goes <laughs> and then he like just explodes into a mushroom yeah. cloud. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't uh, either. But there's so many times where that happens where like Something, <laughs> I think there's one where Squidward is just like on a bike or something, nothing that has any explosives tied to it, <laughs> and he falls off a cliff, <laughs> and it just explodes. <laughs> oh, the first couple of seasons God. of Spongebob were so, so good. Man. What a, I wonder what if I can find those show. on a streaming platform. Uh, Paramount Plus. Oh, is it? Yep. That's got all, at least the most Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon sure, stuff? Yeah. I wanted to get Paramount Plus as like a preview for a little bit because it also has all the MTV stuff. Because I really wanted to like mm. rewatch like Wild Boys and Viva La Bam and fucking uh, Robin Big. Oh yeah, I fuck I loved all of those shows so goddamn Damn, much. Where's the break? Am I on the wall? Oh, there, there we go. go. Yeah, get there. You know, I didn't know this about because we we you know we think that he's just like you know a goofball skater who lucked into you know a good idea with a tv show and millions and all this stuff and he just became kind of like a, a tycoon but like rob dudek yeah he's always actually been like a really calculated dude like he 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 almost spreadsheets man spreadsheet manages his time yeah like every every fucking minute of his day is predetermined wow yeah come on don't uh, don't don't and like i know i know it's kind of the joke to just like deride him on like uh, what's that show he does now that or he, he oh does um, ridiculousness, ridiculousness yeah which is which is you know two thirds of the MTV programming block yeah it's so much yeah but it's also like well I mean there's I guess nobody else vying for that time or Rob's really just got like I think he's probably a majority stakeholder in MTV at this point maybe. But yeah, he's got he's got a shit ton of investments. And oh, stuff did you like see that, that sweet move? You got some sweet moves going on here, but you're also about to die. Get in there. Get in no, there. No, no, I made that mistake once. Oh my god, look at you! Holy shit, I did oh, it. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Don't go off. Oh, <laughs> Don't go, you fucking. Don't you go out there. Oh, look at that a little sneak, a little sneak attack. Oh come on, get. Ah, dude. 
Ah. Oh god. Ah. <laughs> dear. 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 <laughs> Fuck, man. Jesus. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Dude, so much zipping. Oh, oh yeah. That's hard. Yeah, yeah. It ain't easy being cheesy. No. That cheetah, he <laughs> fucking knows. <laughs> Must be a pain to get groceries up here. Oh, <laughs> funny <laughs> Spider-Man. Oh, pest. Why can't you leave me in peace? I, I don't want to be here anymore. Because of the suit? Jail. <laughs> <laughs> the chin's too much. The chin kills. <laughs> I'm not trying to ruin anybody's day. I'm not trying to be funny. But do any of these fuckers <laughs> ever bust out of the wall with big old fun cum shot? <laughs> <laughs> we can do whatever we want we can drink whatever we want and we can say whatever the hell we want big old load of cum shot <laughs> jizz <laughs> you said we could say whatever we want so jizz <laughs> I forgot about that one that was so good Hey, honey, did you meet any new friends? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted I wanted to make a meme with that of like in like w when I was at the agency and anytime I had to do like a fucking networking event and like I would always like talk to people or whatever and be fine. But at the same time, it'd be like, I'm never going to fucking see this person again. <laughs> so I kind of want to make a meme of like me whenever my boss tells me to go to uh I oh, just I lose just the load. <laughs> Fuck. You what the hell? Where is he? You gotta chase him. I know, but where is he? I don't see him. Follow your radar. Oh. So there's a yeah, there's a height meter and there's the That's right. targeting thing. I love how he's zipping from the clouds. Yeah. Dude. Dude. Yeah. That's how you zip when you got spider webs. Yeah. That's how the arachnid webs. kid swings. Yeah, dude. I, I still want scientifically accurate Spider-Man where the webs come out of his ass. Yes. <laughs> have you ever seen? Have you ever seen that? Fuck. I think. Can you target him or no? Um. Yes. Oh, you can. There you go. And don't forget, you can hold down. I know. To go faster. I know. I know. I don't think you know. <laughs> Man, you suck at this game. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that there's a lot less you need to do to actually web zip. Like in all the newer ones, web zipping is a much um, more. Um, web zipping is a much more involved process. Oh, really? Yeah. Like you actually have to like you know take time to like aim and shit. <laughs> hey, don't run away! I'm Spider-Man. I'm threatening. I fix that now. Spider you know what's kind of okay? Glorified so, so, repairman. Right, so think about this, right? Think about this. Think about this. Yeah, think about this, right? I'm thinking about it. So most superheroes are kind of like chummy like you know giga chad vibes where they're just like ah. look at me and my chiseled chin and i'm gonna do the quippy thing of like my chin as a six pack yeah i'm gonna do the thing where like i i solve justice and then make kind of a, a quippy remark about how i'm better than you or something they're like justice always prevails <laughs> you know some some weird shit like that yeah but then Batman, like, scares his villains, right? Mm -hmm. And his whole thing is, like, you know, he always does some kind of, like, dark voice. I know it's always that joke that Christian Bale's is, like, too much or whatever. But every Batman, other than George Clooney, has done, like, a Batman voice. Yeah. 
punishment. And that's they say that in the comics too. Like You're some sometimes they've free. done like more of a, a screechy voice. Sometimes it's more wow. of a guttural roar kind of thing. I, I, I did it. You did it. I'm really proud of you. What do we got time wise? We got ten minutes. You're gonna you're gonna do the boss fight against. Okay, him. I'm gonna fight him. You're gonna be good. Yeah, the vulture segment's really short in this game. Yeah, that's right. Was it an afterthought? Did they just like, I think yeah, let's just throw in vulture. Yeah, kind of. I think they do. It's this, and then scorpion, and then goblin. goblin. Yeah, and the goblin segments are the longest part of the game. I will say. Yeah. This might be a hot take. Actually, you finish your thought. Then I'll come in with my hot. Oh, I was just saying. I think it's interesting that like, I think Batman's really the only like threatening force. Yeah. Like, I guess from a, from a villain's perspective, you're still you're the hero, right? Like, obviously, yeah, sure. obviously, in a comic book, it's it's cartoonishly one sided, where it's like the villain. The villain knows he's evil. He's killing people for all this stuff, and it's mm-hmm. like, but in, in like if there if it was a more like grounded reality thing, it's like a villain, like a small time crook is just trying to get ahead in life. He's just you know doing what he can to. I think like Sandman in Spider Man Three, for as unfortunate as Spider Man Three is in terms of just a bad movie, Thomas Hayden Church does a good job of just like he's a sympathetic villain, right? He's he gets caught up in the wrong reasons because he wants to do good by his daughter who's sick or whatever. Mm-hmm. And I think I think that's a carryover from the comic books because Raimi is pretty good about understanding the source material. Yeah. And Any more web. Yeah, get some web. You got you got tons of health in this. I don't I don't think you're gonna need that much health for this. I'm one, pretty but. good at out. <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe I I I retract that statement. I need more web. Uh, but the whole I'm thing is like, again. if you're if you're a, a villain or the other you know the other guy you know the 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 yin to the yang as it were, are you really gonna be like, yeah sure you're gonna get embarrassed to lose by a Captain America or a you know Mister Fantastic, but are you really like threatened by them? Yeah, right. You're just like. Who the fuck are you, guy? Some dude wearing a wearing a fucking leotard. And in Spider Man's case, on, he's, he's just get a get snarky get teenager. Him. He's a he's a kid who like you know, on the weekends is playing Tony Hawk's pro skater and drinking Surge. <laughs> yeah, he's not a, exactly a threatening force. Right, exactly. But like Batman, it's like I don't want to fucking I don't want to get scared. No I don't want to get. Uh, no one wants to fuck with that. interact with this guy. That's why I really love in like the first Tim Burton movie, yeah. where they have the two burglars at the very beginning, and the one's like in denial. He's like, "Hey, man, shut up! There's no bad out there." And the other guy's like, "Man, I don't fucking know. I don't, I'm not fucking with this shit, dude. I, I heard Tony from like fourth or whatever, you know. Like, I love that that he's like, Ow. the the villains don't want to get fucking caught by the Batman. Yeah, I think that's that's way more." threatening and and appealing in terms of a character can i please move a camera around no no i can't which is also ironic because he's the one with like out superpowers yeah right exactly the one the one that has the most threatening aura is the one that can do the least damage like no one's afraid of superman no, even but though like, he's like, yeah, even though he's supposed he could, like, to be the most powerful, fucking rip you in half with a fingernail. But he, is that soup too cold for you, madam? Oh, he's on the. You better go get him. You better run, squirrel. Huh. There you go. Give him the old one too. Buckle my shoe. Okay, what were you saying now? You, you had a thing. Yes. Um. Oh, hot take. Okay, hot, hot take. take. Yeah, your hot take. On you on on the subject of video game stuff. Yeah. Ooh, there's a power up over there. Oh, seriously? Yeah. Go get that. But don't fall to your death. <laughs> oh yeah. Don't do, don't do that. Oh, sting. sting. Oh, dude, we gonna play some police songs? Fuck yeah, dude. You. Got <laughs> <laughs> square circle square. Eo. <laughs> 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 so, Come on down, 
Hot take. Yeah. Um, as far as... Okay, hold on. I need to get back. Um, okay, where where is he? Okay. He's almost down. As far as video game design is concerned, is he going? Is he going down? Yeah. Obviously, this is like a very linear game. Like you, you sure. play through. Um, get ready. Square, circle, square. Sing. Sing. Sting. Oh, there he is. So, as far as video game design goes, and I punched you there, vulture standing there, in all my webs of gold. Yes. Come on, old timer. Yes. Linear playthrough, right? <laughs> Which, at the time that this game came out, uh, came came out, came down. Um, wow. At the time that this game came out. Yes. Linear playthrough was like that's just how it was. Yeah. You know, you go from level to level to level to level. Yep. The only you know mainstream outliers of that would have been you know um, Zelda was always like an open world experience. Um, so, you know, in in a sense, yes, but it's still at the end of the day, you still have to complete all of the dungeons. You not in the, not in the first one. Well, yeah. Or like what's. Mm -hmm. You can't like you can do things in a certain way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't have to. Kind of, I mm -hmm. guess. And then there was the other like um, the other method, like Metroid style, where you had areas. Yeah. But you had to constantly like revisit things and get more power ups and, and then yeah, go back. backtrack and yeah. stuff. Yeah. A lot of backtracking. Grand Theft Auto was kind of like I, not, that was always open world. Like, like yeah. kind of open world. There's still like a main story, but you have to like you you basically just progress yeah. as you do all these different side missions. It didn't become like the standard, the norm until after Spider-Man Two. Yeah, for me, you know, and that's when like everything was an open world game. Yeah, but there is an art form. Uh, we have a problem, sir. and Our systems are a level of, of play interaction that a really good linear game has. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you played the first Last of Us. That's a really good game. Um, it all, it, you're always engaged and you're wrapped into the story. The problem with open world games is the illusion of the story is kind of like gone because well yes. I'm, yeah, I know that I technically need to be going to this new location to save whoever I'm just gonna like grind for a bit though yeah you know what I mean exactly so that's <clears throat> these cutscenes don't look bad they're all right spiders spiders everywhere I mean they're not great they look better than Beast Wars <laughs> <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yes. Beast Wars does absolutely slap, though. I love that show, man. That show is my jam. No. 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 So, yeah, you have to, like, save Scorpion, and then you have to fight Scorpion. Ah, uh, weird. Yeah. So I feel like oh, I'm at... Use your web yank. Oh, dude, yank him. Yank him off the walls, dude. I feel like I'm at a point in my gaming journey now where I almost would rather play a really well-designed linear playthrough game Yeah. rather than a big, it's going to be huge going back to the um, open world game. Shocker. Because, you know, it's like, it's like let me play through the game. Let me just, like, I just want to play through the game. Yes. You know? I agree. I don't want to spend 100 plus hours on this. I can't. Yeah. To, you know, explore all the areas. And there's games that, like, do it incredibly well. Games mm -hmm. that I... Ow. Shit. Okay. Well. Protect Scorpion. And then... Am I gonna sting? Yeah, dude, sting him. <laughs> oh. Come on, guys. S Suck Boom! It. <laughs> yeah, be <clears throat> 17 more of these little fuckers. Oh, really? Do any of these fuckers. <laughs> uh. I agree with you. And so, and actually, the the second in the Arkham series, Arkham City, yeah, I think was a really good 
I really do want to play that one because I know that one's. Oh, dude, Scorpion's gonna die. Yeah, he totally is. It's like it's I'm, it's an open, it's an open, open world, world game, but it's one of those it's it's those things where like you start the game completely open, and as you depending on like which side missions you do and how you like it like it basically funnels right. Yeah. So depending on like which missions you pick and and what order you do certain things in, then you like slowly narrow. Uh, down to the main story, and I think that is is particularly effective. Um, and that's, I guess, that's kind of how that new Sonic game kind of is too. Frontiers, which I, I fucking really really enjoyed. Yeah. Um, Get a little healing action you can, here. Oh, he died. Yeah. Oh yeah, he died. Yeah, yeah, he's dead. Ali was lost. Ali was <laughs> was dead. Oh. Allie was dead to begin with. <laughs> uh, well, we're going to pick this up on the next episode where we find out who'd win. Who'd win? One, one <laughs> other arachnid boy? Yeah. Who would win? Some spider guy, some scorpion guy, or some other spider guy, or some scorpion guy? Because I'm going to save him, then I'm going to feed him. I'm going to feed him. You're going to feed him? Yeah. Well, I'm going to save him. I'm going to feed him, and then I'm going to beat him up. Kevin, I'm going to feed you to my tarantula. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, you're such a disease. Dude, you Kevin the, had a hard life. You know what the French call? Leg is on the door. Look what you did, you How little did you jerk. How did you say that? Leg is on the door. Leg is on It's just incompetent, but with lay. Lay incompetent. Yeah. Ton. Les incompetents. Les incompetents. Yeah. That's all it is. I don't. I don't speak the French. Les que sont petits. Les que sont petits. Les 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 ma ma petit croissant. <laughs> I fucking what is that? In the oh, mask? the mask. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Je de do, je de wido. I don't care. Yeah. <laughs> je de mi, je de do, je de wido. <laughs> what are you doing? Would you told me to freeze. freeze. All right, all right, and freeze. <laughs> What a what a movie. Picture of Calloway's wife. Margaret, you son of a <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Jeez, I thought you'd have the sense of humor after all. You married her. <laughs> he puts him in handcuffs. Yes. Doyle. Oh my god. I told you about the Cuban Pete thing, right? No. Oh, okay. Real quick before we end this episode. Yeah. So during the Cuban Pete sequence, mm -hmm. the special effects crew was supposed to add some CG to his dancing. Really? Yep. But then they gave it back to uh, computer effects. It was either they gave it to computer effects or the director saw the footage and was just like, no, he, he is so fucking animated. <laughs> we can't make Jim this Carrey any better. Is such a live action cartoon that there is no reason to add anything to this. Wow. Like all of his fucking weird ass movements <laughs> dancing on the fucking light pole. Yes. And, and like, they're like, no, there's no reason to do. It's going to look, it's going to, you're just going to detract from what he just did. So wow. Yeah, they, they didn't touch it. That's amazing. Yeah. That's amazing. unbelievable. Uh, all right. So uh, join us next time. Where we find out. Wait, we did that already. Yeah, we already did. <laughs> okay, yeah, we'll just, okay, we'll, we'll see you. Bye. Bye.